the Base Lab. Today we're going to be breaking down the Motown classic Respect by the Queen of Soul herself, Aretha Franklin. Let's get to it. The song Respect has three parts, and we'll break them down one at a time. At the end, I think you'll find it's not too hard to put them together yourself and reassemble the whole song. The song Respect is in C major, and I'm going to start with the first part in open position. First I'll play it slow so you can follow along. Let's take a look from the right hand perspective. The second half of the chorus, that's the first section, is going to be just like the first part, except it's going to be a chromatic stepwise movement to the note C to get us to the verse. It's going to look something like this at the end. Notice I move positions into second position too. So let me play it up to speed and you can see how the whole chorus looks. Now that you've mastered the chorus and you've moved up into second position, let's stretch out your left hand a little bit and learn how to play the verse. I'll play it slow first. Let's look at that from the left hand perspective and the reach involved. Let's add the ending and play it up to speed. Bridge is the last section we need to learn, and it's based on a rhythmic figure which happens throughout. Let's first learn the rhythmic figure, and then we can add it in. I'm going to put pinky on the fourth fret of D, and I'm going to alternate index and middle finger on my right hand. The rhythm sounds like this. Let's look at the right hand of that. Up to speed. Practice that first. Once you've gotten that, let's add the real notes. Slowly, the section's going to sound like this. Hey, I hope you enjoyed this lesson, and maybe even learned a little respect for the Queen of Soul herself, Aretha Franklin. When you get good at this song, try go to the playlist section and play it along with the original recording. Good luck.